happy Monday. Oh, it's a new week. It's Thanksgiving week. So happy Thanksgiving. I hope everybody had an amazing Thanksgiving. I am trying to wake up, like literally just rolled out of bed. I wish I was still sleeping. A few vlogs ago, we talked about how we had some water damage in Mason's bathroom with some mold growing. Well, today is the day that they're coming. They're coming this morning to start to remove all the mold. So I'm up. I just need to make sure I'm dressed and ready for him to be here to take care of all that. Hopefully it goes smoothly. Hopefully the damage, the mold isn't really bad and it's just, if you go back a couple vlogs ago, I showed you the whole wall and everything. So you can go back and see that, but we're hoping that it's not behind Mason's shower. So stay tuned, I'll let you guys know. Um, Mason is off of school and practice all week this week because it is Thanksgiving. So he is sleeping in, although he does have to get up soon. Also because he's volunteering the next two days at like a youth baseball camp. So that's what he'll be doing the next couple mornings. And the boys will be going to a Phoenix Suns game this week. So stay tuned for that. Should be a good week. Obviously we have Thanksgiving coming as well. But right now you guys, I'm literally, <laughs> I'm gonna drink some coffee and then I have to get going because they'll be knocking on the door here soon. I'm happy. I'm happy because the mold's out of our house. And I'm also happy because when they gave us the quote, they gave us like the worst case scenario and he said it wasn't that bad. So mold was not behind Mason's shower. So we didn't have to pull off his shower or anything crazy like that. I can go show you guys. I meant to go up there and show you the before and then the after, <laughs> but with Mason heading to baseball camp this morning and them knocking on the door, I didn't have time to get up there. So I apologize, but I promise you, if you go, I think two vlogs back, I showed it in the very beginning of the vlog, if you wanted to see what we were dealing with. We definitely caught the, the water situation before it got out of hand upstairs. So thank God to that. Um, now, and this is what, the, when I saw the quote, I don't know why I was thinking that was the quote for like everything, like them replacing drywall and our baseboard and stuff but no 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 no. that's just to remove the mold the yucky part the stuff that i was concerned about because i know mold in your house could be very scary and leads to health situations and stuff like that so i'm like i gotta get i didn't want my dog licking it all that kind of stuff i need to get this out of the house so that's done now we need to get somebody out to do the drywall so i'll show you but the the guy was in and out you guys it was like an hour and a half and he took it, he was super sweet. In fact, I need to leave him a review because he left the place looking cleaner than I think it was when he showed up. But I'll take you upstairs, show you guys what we have going on now. All right, that's what we're dealing with. And it's exactly what he said he was gonna have to do. I don't know, what is that? Like three feet by maybe three feet-ish. The baseboard is removed because that's where, so basically the water was coming off Mason's back wall and just coming right down here into all of our drywall right here. So this is where I saw the mold when I decided to pull the paint that came off in like one chunk. There was just mold right here. But there you go. <laughs> that's what we're dealing with. But Mason can now use the shower. I don't have to worry about the mold keeping the door shut, all the things. So yeah, we'll have to see about getting this fixed. But with it being Thanksgiving week, that might have to be next week. And even next week, you guys, I have a lot going on next week too. So it might have to stay like this for a little bit, but at least Mason can use his bathroom again. Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday this week. It's gonna go by fast with Thanksgiving. Good morning, Mason. He's up. Morning. He's about ready to head off. Day two of the volunteering for the youth baseball camp. Mace, I'm proud of you. He's been waking up on his break early. But for the next five days, you can sleep in. Yeah. Like, I was even sleeping in, you guys. I barely rolled out of bed. Um, and I heard Mason's alarm going off, and I was like, oh, I better get up, get my day started too. Yesterday, where'd you guys end up going? After camp, some of the boys that volunteered at the camp, let me get better lighting, there we go. Well, I went to a mall, but we went to the mall because it has shields now. Shields, you guys, Arizona now has a shields. How many of you guys have shields? So we went to the shields when we were in Utah for a baseball tournament. 
and the Shields in Reno when we were there for a baseball tournament. And now Arizona, we have our own Shields. Unfortunately, it's a little far yeah. from our house, but the boys made the trip out and Mason had the best shopping day. Let's see. So I got this from Shields. Oh, just the National League Champions hat. I love right. it. It's so cool. It's just a little snapback. They had a nice view on it, so. Oh yeah, Bar my bargain shopper, I love it. I've taught him well, you guys, I've yeah. taught him well. I feel like I had to get like a piece. I love it. This was also on sale, believe it or not. This is insane. It's a nice little Coyotes pullover. Little throwback and there's the back right there. Love it. So, so what was the original price on this thing? Uh, this thing normally costs $100. 100 bucks? Yeah. And what'd you buy it for? 20 Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Bargain shopper. Perfect. And it's awesome looking. So he had fun yesterday shopping. Came home and then we watched the Eagles beat the Chiefs last night. Finally. <laughs> what a game though. <laughs> it wasn't a pretty win. But we'll take the win. But yeah, we're waking up. Mason's about ready to head off. But it's Tuesday. We're getting there. We're getting to, you ready for Thanksgiving? Uh, ready for some turkey? Yeah. All right, well, you have fun today. And I know these little kids look up to you guys. So I'm proud of you for volunteering your time. Yeah, of course. What's up, guys? Got the Suns jersey on. So I think you know where we're going. Forgot to vlog at home, so. We are here. Yes, we are uh, driving downtown. We are headed our way to a Phoenix Suns Portland Trailblazers game. The return of DeAndre Ayton. Yep. But uh, yeah, we forgot to vlog before we left the house, but we, we want to get out of the house. We're meeting Papa, Clintus, Sierra Bryce, Sierra's boyfriend Jacob, um, and we're all going to go get some food and then go down to the basketball game. So the next couple clips we'll show you more of that. Sounds like a plan. And we have made it. Footprint Center. Oh, yeah. We have not been here. Well, I know me, you, and mom have not been here. Mom is not here, of course, but we have not been here since they redid it. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see what it looks should like. Should be now. cool to see it. But here we are. And Chase Field, of course. We got to show that. Home Come of on. the National League champions. All the way over there, you know. Can you even hear us? Yeah, it's loud. Probably not. But we made our way to the seat. Oh, yeah. Bryce, Clint, Sports cool. Sierra, Jacob, Papa's over there. The court is awesome. Hopefully you guys can hear me. Suns win. Suns win. Yeah. So we got to go to a play-in tournament game too. But in season tournament. In season, whatever it's called. I don't even know. The court was cool. <laughs> yeah, the court was different. It was cool. But it was a fun, fun game. But now we gotta find our car nice and get home. Yeah, the renovations were really cool, huh? Yeah, yeah. We haven't been there in forever, so it look almost looked like a whole new stadium. It's smaller though compared to the baseball stadium. Yeah, for sure. Good morning everyone. Happy Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving. 
and I might completely regret this, but I'm headed to the grocery store. Seriously. Literally throw on a hat, let's do this. I know it's gonna be crazy and I don't really need to go, but I am craving tacos for dinner tonight and I don't have corn tortillas because I wanna like deep fry, like totally be bad. Does that sound good, Mace? Okay. <laughs> so I have everything I need to make for the recipe that I'm bringing Thanksgiving tomorrow. I did that over the weekend. My list is very short, so wish me luck. I'm about ready to head off to fries the day before Thanksgiving. What am I thinking? I am back, and you guys, it really wasn't that bad. It was definitely worse over the weekend when I went with Jack. I don't know, maybe it's gonna get busier as the day goes on. It's only barely noon, so maybe I just beat the rush. But I got my five growth bags of groceries. I was in and out. I can make tacos tonight. I picked up some orange juice to go with breakfast tomorrow, some cinnamon rolls to add to the breakfast tomorrow, and we should be good to go. But that was good. I am so excited. Like I said earlier, I've been craving tacos, and that's what we're having for Thanksgiving Eve dinner. First round is ready. So who's gonna claim these? Either I hear Mason, he's coming. So we got lettuce, tomato, Jack just shredded fresh cheese, got sour cream, all the toppings. That's what we're having for dinner tonight. Good afternoon, everyone. It is Thursday, it is Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. I know it already passed for you guys, but today is our Thanksgiving and I didn't vlog this morning, I'm grateful. Like we all got up around the same time. Jack walked the dog while I made breakfast. We all sat down, including Mason, and had breakfast together. And then I had to get quick to work to get my um, sweet potatoes going in the crock pot to take to Thanksgiving dinner today. Last year, we ended up going to a restaurant for Thanksgiving because my dad is uh, 75 years old, just turned 75, and he's done. He's like, I've cooked enough um, turkeys. So last year, he made dinner reservations or lunch Thanksgiving reservations at a restaurant and it was good but part of Thanksgiving is having leftovers and waiting for your turkey to be done all the things hanging out with family so this year I'm like Tiff let's do Thanksgiving me and you will do the turkey all the things so we were gonna go over to my sister's house but scratch that her father-in-law invited them over for Thanksgiving, so he included us and my parents. So instead of doing like two Thanksgiving, my sister's like, I don't wanna have two Thanksgivings, we're all just gonna go over to my sister's father-in-law's house, so Clint's dad's house for Thanksgiving, which we ended up going there last year after we did the whole restaurant thing because he invited us, he's like, come over, don't just go home, like come over, you know, hang out, have seconds, have leftovers, all the things. So we ended up doing that and it was fun. So that's what we're doing this year. About ready to head out, we're loaded up. Ace is not happy. I'm sorry, buddy. We're gonna go eat turkey and then we'll be back later. Look at him, he's ready though. Maybe mommy will bring us some turkey home. Of course, like usual, we're waiting for Mason. He's almost ready. He'll be downstairs and we're gonna hit the road. There's my boys, all three of them. Boys, I'm grateful, thankful for all of you, including this one. We're, Ace is gonna watch football while we're eating our turkey, but we're about ready to head out. You guys ready? Me, my papa, happy Thanksgiving. Oh, looks young. It's got herb butter smeared all over. So good. Crock pot, crock pot, crock pot. Pans, I don't know. Crock pot, that's mine. Well, Dad didn't have to cook the turkey, but he's still carving the turkey. <laughs> Plate number one. The basketball player, how many plates will he get down? Maybe like, maybe three. <laughs> that's number one. One plate of dessert. Oh yeah, I can't Maybe two. There's a lot of dessert There's in there too. There's like four pies, your sweet potato casserole. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you gotta get your sweet potato casserole. That's I'll what I brought. That on my dessert plate. That is dessert. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, Mason's joining in the fun. Plate one there. Okay. You forgot the roll. Where's your roll? Oh, I forgot a roll too. <laughs> They're hidden. They're over by the oven. Jack found the rolls. Round one. These are for him. <laughs> Let's see that, Jack. Oh, you got my sweet potatoes. Yes, I yeah. said sweet potatoes for him. Here's the fun part. Best part. Attaboy, Clint. The best part. 
It's time. I see ya. <laughs> Ace needs a little turkey dinner too. He's eating his dog food right now, but don't worry guys, we brought home leftovers. I think I might give him a little piece of our turkey. What do you think, Jack? Oh, for sure. It was a good Thanksgiving. It was I had a great five. Thanksgiving. Holy moly, way too much food. I'm ready to go for a walk, yeah. Maybe we should go for a walk. Oh. He's like, hmm? Oh, he's like, let me finish this first. Look at him. Slow down there, buddy. It was a good time. Mace? Yeah. Did you have a good Thanksgiving? I did, yeah. You did? Are you full and happy? I'm very tired. How, tired? Yeah. That's the turkey. It'll do that to you. How's your fantasy team doing? Fine. Fine? I need to check on mine. There's three football games today. I think there's one tomorrow. They're calling it the Black Friday game. That was one about to start, too. Yeah, I said there's three today, right? Three today, one tomorrow. Yeah. I need to check on my scores. Good morning, everyone. Oh. I have my glasses on, that's funny. Um, it's Friday, I slept in, Mason's still sleeping. Poor Jack had to go back to work today. I had my glasses on, cause you guys, I woke up and started shopping. It's Black Friday. Did you guys get any good deals? I just ordered the my parents' Christmas gift. Um, I have some stuff in the cart for Mason, but I want Jack to get home, cause I want to make sure that he agrees with me and the choices I made, so. Good deals out there, you guys. Hopefully you did some shopping. Um, but now I need to get to work because I need to clean this house because it is time to take down all of the fall decorations. And speaking of Christmas, we will be decorating for Christmas at some point this weekend. So I'm looking forward to that. And on that note, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog. It probably is a pretty decent one with the basketball game and Thanksgiving and all the things. I hope you all had a wonderful week and you're having a great weekend. Don't forget to like this video, comment something in the comment section, subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time.